Krogan kill shot. <laughs> previously unknown historical events. Where's the target, Glenn? He is searching for a secret vault. He did not wish to be disturbed. What? I thought he was you. <sighs> Go find him again. Stupid machine. your friends and you end up in a mech fight. You're welcome, Team Mako. <laughs> soldiers calling themselves Razor Squad is just ahead. They wish to inflict bodily harm on you. Also, I discovered an Elcor mating totem in Vault 347B. Fascinating. Hammerhead and Mako, keep pushing ahead. Right. I might throw up a little bit now, if that's okay with everyone. Hammerhead 
Commander, the other you wishes to pass on a message. Shepard, save yourself the trouble. Once I have what I came here for, you won't matter anymore. Now go, drone. Deliver it. Year 710 CE, Krogan Genophage. Deployment, Vault T-101. We have our orders. Release of the Genophage against the Krogan has been authorized. scientists perished. I would like to have discussed the Elcor mating totem with them. Team Hammerhead, we're headed to the next level. What's your location? Hammerhead, do you copy? Intruders have been detected. Please locate the nearest... There's Team Mako. We'll try to clear a path, Commander. Hammerhead's gone ahead. Team Mako, we're coming up behind. What's your status? Mako, where are you? are not in question. It's his background that the Council has no knowledge of. Shepard was born to a career military family, growing up on various... Commander, do you copy? What's your status? The other you is jamming our radios. Hammerhead and Mako are trying to get ahead and cut him off. But I've been hit and need help. Please, hurry. Please wait for security personnel to arrive.
That can't be good. Brooks, the vault sealed us in. Is there an override? I'm not seeing one. Cortez? Brooks? Do you read me? Is anyone on this frequency? The short answer is no. They're not. The longer answer involves your friends trapped in Iridium vaults and forgotten for... well... forever. Others know about this. About you. The Alliance will stop you. What do you think, Staff Analyst Brooks? Will the Alliance stop us? I wouldn't know. I don't actually work for them. Who the hell are you? And do you really think I won't track you down? My name doesn't matter. I never keep the same one for more than a few days. And if the elusive man hasn't found me yet, you never will. You're Cerberus? Was. Mr. Elusive and I didn't see eye to eye. He's indoctrinated, whereas I prefer the whispers in my head to be my own. Why not come to me? We could have worked together. In a way, we did. I'm the one who put together all those dossiers on your suicide mission. The Collector Base? There was the Salarian Doctor, the Asari Justicar, the Turian. Nice to have finally met you, Archangel. Charmed. They were all mistakes. We were a pro-human group who started looking to aliens for help. So I bided my time. And when I found another you who agreed, I woke him up. The minute. The second I get out of here, I'm gonna take your head and mount it in the Normandy CIC. Then I'm gonna mount his head next to yours. Then I'm gonna take both of your heads and space them out the airlock. Not before I ground their skulls to dust. That sounds very dramatic. And if someone like, say, Commander Shepard made the threat, I'd be worried. But you're not, Shepard. Not anymore. You had Miranda. I have her. Mine has more bite. It was fun while it lasted. What are you doing? Setting things right. Remember this? You were the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. Except somewhere along the way, you forgot about your entire species. You've saved more alien lives than you have human. I don't care what species they are. Every life counts. But maybe a clone wouldn't understand that. <laughs> you know the one thing they can't duplicate? Our handprint. Life gives it a shape, not DNA. Which is a problem. Computer. Update Council records. Subject, Shepard. Human Spectre. Accessing record. Please input new data. Biometric identifier updated. Good day, Commander Shepard. Now, if you'll excuse me, the Normandy needs its captain. So... I should go. Farewell, Commander. I guess this is where legends go to die. Refresh my memory. Didn't we used to win these things back in the old days? He said, I should go. Do I sound like that? As long as I've known you. Yeah. Crazy thought, but maybe we should be worrying about this impregnable vault we've been sealed inside forever. I'm more confident than he is. More in control. With me, it's more like, that's all for now. Spoken like a Krogan. Show him who's boss. 
probably not a lot of air in here either. An hour, if we're lucky. Or sometimes, I'll talk to you later. Because you know what? I never do. Leave him wanting more. Shepard, please, why aren't you more worried about this? Hmm? Oh, Glyph, you still out there? Yes, Commander. Unlock this damn thing and go find the others. No one steals my ship. Not even me. I've got room for Shepard plus two. And figure it out fast because the other Shepard is stealing my ship. What? I was hoping to come. I hear ya. Never seem to get picked. Joker will come back for you. I promise. This is why I hate Shorely. I swear you parked the ship for five minutes. Can you contact Citadel Flight Control and get them to deny the departure request? Try. All the comm lines in the area are jammed. Probably to make it easier for them to steal my ship. We'll stop them. Even if we lose the Normandy, we can go to the Council and prove you're the real Shepard. No. He changed the logs to make his biometrics the official ones. We can't prove anything. Yes, that. Can we all just agree that it'd be easier to not let Shepard's evil clones steal the Normandy? Don't worry. You'll get your ship back. We'd better. I just got the seat broken in how I like it. Okay, Citadel systems are targeting the car. Any closer and they open fire. Get back and pick up the others. ASAP. Right. They can't have gotten far. Unless they called a cab or something. Good. I needed to kill something.
is about to take off. When we want to take off, there's a half hour of pre-flight checks. They just gun the engine and go? Maybe we should skip the pre-flight ourselves next time. I'm strongly considering it. You, you fired me! Dishonorable discharge for conduct unbecoming! You kicked me off the ship with barely enough time to grab my toothbrush. That's Decision Pro Mark IV. It uses mass effect fields to break up plaque and massage the gums. Yes, I told you that. And I remember, because I'm the real shepherd. And someone just threw me off the ship! If it... Wasn't you? Shepard's got a clone. Makes sense when you think about it. I can explain more later. For now, it's sealed. The engines are online. They're about to take off. Is there anyone still aboard who can help us? No. I was only there because I helped with the Normandy retrofits back on Earth. Everyone else is on shore leave. Okay. You know this ship inside and out. Can you get me inside? There's an emergency exit hatch for evacuations. It should be right here. Manual lock. And it's only meant to be open from the other side. Any ideas? From this side, a very precise mass effect field, maybe. If you told me this morning that a toothbrush was going to save the Normandy, I'd have been very skeptical. standing right in front of you. Are we clear? It's better this way. Wouldn't you rather take him down yourself? Armory. Find him. Slow him down. Pretty sure we broke Trainer's toothbrush getting the hatch open. Remind me to reimburse her for that. I'll make a note of it. A little cramped in here. Quiet. Can't risk them hearing us up top. Yeah, yeah. Get off my tail. Alright, get a patrol going. Find Shepard. The real one. Hey, what do you mean by slow down? We're allowed to kill Shepard if we have to, right? He said slow him down because he thinks we're cannon fodder. Oh, well, shit. Watch out, they're here in the sky.
You always wanted to have a firefight on the CIC of my ship? And it isn't even my birthday! This is the real Shepard. I need you to lock down the Normandy. Can you help us out? Edie? Do you copy? Guess she's got problems of her own. Let's get to the cargo bay. Please send this to an animal shelter for proper disposal, as a warship is not an appropriate... Oh, that is not okay. So, anyone want to talk about their people's history? Nope. So I'm the only one who misses when we used to chat in the elevators back on the Citadel? Yep. So disappointed. You want to stop shooting up my ship? It's not your ship. It will be. I've taken your name, your Spectre rank, even your fingerprints. And then you left me to die. Only I didn't. You think fake fingerprints are gonna fool the Council? Or hack it? How's that big plan looking now? <laughs> Squad to the shuttle. but one more mercenary thug.
Damn it! And you're running out! That makes us a perfect target. No, that makes us the bait. Do you want me to drive? No. Damn it. Launch the shuttle and blow that thing out of the sky. Makes you so damn special. Why you and not me? Hang on. We got you. <sighs> Thanks. What about this pie jack? Here. Take my hand. 
And then? And then you live. For what? Fortunately, they weren't here long enough to do much real damage. Although I may need some help from James cleaning up the damage to the shuttle bay. Plus, they overloaded the heat diffusion system firing at us. Not sure if you noticed, but shuttle guy here did some crazy stunt flying to keep us in one piece. That's nice to fly something a little more maneuverable than the Kodiak. What about Edie? Is she back online? I am once again fully in control of the Normandy. Glad to hear it. What about the Mercs? Any survivors? Just one crappy-ass pilot and her. Alliance has taken her to a high-security facility. Maybe she can give them some dirt on Cerberus. I'll be more than happy to cooperate with the authorities. Until you escape. Me? Escape? But I'm not a field agent. Stop. Just stop. You betrayed me and the Alliance in the middle of a war. I was young and naive. Admit it, Commander. You'll miss me. Not at this range, I won't. Uh, maintenance to the shuttle bay? The rest of the squad's waiting outside. We'll have the Normandy back in shape in no time. Appreciate it. Well, what happens on shore leave stays on shore leave. <laughs> Come on. Maybe we can take some actual time off. No explosions or anything. Just us. Don't know about no explosions, but just us sounds perfect. So, after a hard day spent fighting an evil clone, you know what comes next. A nap? Please. We party down. Well, I gotta get going. Things to settle up before I head back to Tuchanka. Always fires to put out when you're in charge, right? Let me know if you want to hang out or if you're having that party. See ya! Party, huh? Well, no pressure. No one's gonna make you throw a party. All right. Good idea. Let's set it up. I've channeled discretionary funds into your account for the purchase of any celebratory supplies, Commander. Okay. Edie and Cortez and Trainer are in. What? I have also informed Dr. Tassoni about any potential upcoming celebrations. Wait, wait. I'm in charge of the guest list. Yeah, so there's no uninvite button on this thing? All right, but when it's time, I invite the rest. Cortez just invited James. So... Fine. I'm gonna go out and see how much trouble I can get into without snapping a femur. Members of your crew have expressed interest in spending time with you, Commander. You can check your private terminal for messages. If you require activities, Silver Sun Strip has an arcade in addition to the casino. You have also been granted a complimentary pass to the combat simulator. Thanks, Cliff. Guess I should take advantage of some shore leave myself.
Commander, if you would like to begin the party, you will need to purchase supplies on the Strip first. I have already placed credits in your account for this purpose. Greetings, Commander. Shepard. I didn't know you could play. Actually, this is the only song I know. Why's that? There was always something more important to do. A ruin to uncover, intel to gather, a commander to save. <laughs> you couldn't sit still long enough. <laughs> could you? Is there something special about this song? On one of my first digs, a storm swept in. We were trapped inside. I was so restless. I wanted to get back to work. One of the other archaeologists, Dr. Olena, had this keyboard. She took it everywhere. She taught me to play this song while we waited. It's a good song. Thank you, Shepard. I've always loved that song. sure you don't run off to something more important. I can't imagine what that would be. We should do this more often. Yes, well, maybe after. Every day after. Shepard. so that you might work here? Yes, thank you, Glyph. Glyph, can you copy that song to my personal files on the Normandy? Certainly, Dr. Tassoni. an afternoon of acquiring material possessions for our associates. Shopping? I, I guess we could. Did you have a place in mind? Physical proximity is unnecessary. The extranet provides a greater variety of services while retaining entertainment value. Jeff has lent me his credit chit on the condition that I enjoy myself and, quote, live it up like a girly girl. <laughs> you don't have money of your own? I am not formally employed. I have no legal standing in Citadel space. I could turn to crime, but that would look bad on a resume. We'll get you your own funds sometime. But today, what's first? I believe Jeff would be surprised and pleased if I got him a gift. What would you recommend?
Start with something both of you can enjoy. What do you do together? We interact most closely when we are flying. It occurs to me that he does not have a sky car for traveling around the Presidium. Here, the 2187 Blackout has a top speed of 650 kilometers per hour, making it the most powerful sports sky car in its class. That sounds like it'll get Joker's blood pumping. Five-year warranty? Replacement parts? No, wait! I fail to see what is wrong. When you buy someone a present, it's best not to bankrupt them. You want to rent it. I see. Perhaps for a day or a weekend, then. Who's next? You are. Close your eyes. Um, are we getting married? No. There is a jeweler on the Citadel who produces these. They're made from metals from each Council homeworld. Each metal compounds with the last, making the rings stronger. He calls them victory rings. Due to material shortages, only a few exist. Rare is nice. Unique is better. Are you... valuing me? It's the thought that counts. And you had a good one. I have heard that expression. That's why I recorded a resonance map of my quantum bit arrays when I had the idea. If you read my extensive log files and extrapolate from my nitrogen vacancy centers, you can visualize the thought precisely. That's a long way for a joke, Edie. Did I have you for a few seconds there? Not even close. Who's next? I was thinking of something for Liara. Hey, loco. Nice place. Might not look so nice after throwing that party you were talking about. You wouldn't trash my new apartment, would you, James? Me? No. Never. <whistles> nice view. But this place, it's just so... not what I'm used to. Which is... I grew up on the beach on the Pacific, so, you know, water, sand, real air. You miss it? Yeah. And the people. Yeah, I get that. It's tough being away from home. Yeah. How do you make it work? I wouldn't know how to survive otherwise. I'm a soldier, but I'm still human. I hear that. So did you really come up here to talk about my personal life? Oh, shit. Right. I wanted to show you. What do you think? It's a lot of responsibility. And you haven't passed the tests yet. I know. And I heard every word you said. I'm 100% committed to this. Glad to hear it. Anyway, that's it. Just wanted to show you that bad boy. I gotta get back to the Normandy. Esteban wants my help working on the shuttle. Thanks for coming by, James. This is gonna be a perfect place for a fiesta. Hasta la vista, Shepard. Catch you later, Shepard.